Good morning, good morning. Welcome to 4 by 8 Paper Stuff. This is Beth. Welcome to My Time to Journal, an untrained person playing with lots of art supplies and having fun. Join me. Good morning, good morning. Part 2, Volume 2. I have said this before, but I always skip this page and I always skip this page. Because I kind of like to do preface or whatever you want to call it but this is volume two so I really don't need to but I'm still going to where is my clip I think is where it's supposed to be I guess I really don't need one but all right so when we left off we had crossed or getting ready to cross into Niger I can't remember if we had crossed into that or not but we are in a little town we mean Michael Palin it's in a little town called Ingol and it's very the kickoff to some of the stereotypical sand dunes. So we're getting into that, it looks like. Um, admittedly, I don't have my legs, my, my journaling legs underneath me yet. I painted this, which is just um, sketch paper with this color from my new paint set, which is gorgeous. And it is called Sassafras. So it's a really, really mustardy okra yellow. And then I went over it with that color, which is a, it's called maple. So the darker spots are that. And just made my little journaling spots. And now I'm going to get into the meat of the page, which I have no idea what it's going to be. So here we go. One other thing. One other thing before I get started. I'm, this is so silly, but I made 100 subscribers. <laughs> I've been struggling between 96 and 97 for two years. I know. I'm not in it for the views, for the viewers. I'm in it for the community that I have made, which I have several very... Um, uh, consistent watchers and commenters, and I appreciate all of that very much, um, very much, very much, and enjoy that part of it, and that's why I'm doing it. That the fact that I love to make the videos too, it's creative outlet for me also. Um, so to say that I have a hundred subscribers after not being on for a week, do people like me better when I don't talk? That is my question of the day. Hmm. Not that I'm going to take that personally. So here we go. Let's do art. So it was about right here where my sister called. So while she was saying the most intelligent things I've ever heard in my entire life, just in case she watches, that's what I have to say. Um, and I was cutting things and trimming white space off of things and peeling the cardboard off of this piece of postcard and just trying to get everything together and in order for when she got off the phone. Because I film with my phone. It works for me. It's perfectly fine for me. Um, for what I do. Maybe that's why I only have 100 subscribers. Hmm. I don't know. Anyhow. Uh, trying to get this on here straight. And all of that. Stay in frame. Sort of. Um, is me trying to get a background. And then adding to it. I'm not crazy about this one. But it's my first day back. I haven't done this in 9 days or something like that. Which is insane. For me, um, so I, I, it's going to take a day or two for me to get back in the swing of things. Those little letters are from Hall a picture of Halloween fabric, and I cut out the letters that spelled sand, and have a camel train going here onto sand dune, and then, I, and some of my stuff that I got, uh, my haul, I got some of those slides, so I traced one onto a paper bag, and inked it up a little bit, distressed it a little bit. And am filling it up with um, South Asian, Indonesian uh, statues. But does it matter to me that they're not on the same continent? Or maybe they are. I don't know. No, they're not. Anyhow, no. It, ju it just is the color and the um, technique and the aesthetic of all of it. There's a piece of magazine picture. I was just trying to get stuff together that I thought could make a good background. And I didn't want to cover up the camels completely because I love this like a 
camel train from a drone type of view. I love that. I think that's kind of cool looking. Um, and I'm just trying to collage some pieces of paper together uh, to make a background. That's all I'm doing. Um, I punched out a couple of different circles and things out of some scraps and using some of those. And those little teeny tiny circles are pictures of bugs that I have made that I put on my own printables. And once they're that tiny, you really can't tell what they are, but they add a little bit of texture and I'm good with all of that. That's all I wanted was texture. So yes, I've enjoyed this um, immensely today. Uh, I feel like it's going to take me a day or two to get back in the groove, but I'm back. Thanks for watching. Thanks for 100 and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye.